Hey guys, it's me again, and uh, today for a change we're going to do a tutorial, and um, it's going to be on this hidden door. Now, I made a few changes to the hidden door, so it can either be like that, which I quite like, or, 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 or well actually, hitting the button's not going to change it, don't know why, um, or it can be like this. It's just a little bit different, instead of this stair being sucked in, this one will be pushed out. So, it's like... That. So, just a little different, but um, I don't know. This one, for some reason, the wiring turned out a lot messier because I needed to hook up three different parts instead of only two. So, I don't know. I, 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 just, I just don't know. This one's like the one in the video, though, so, so I don't know. <laughs> Because the stair gets pushed out in the video, and I realized that when I took another look at the video. And, uh, so yeah, that's how that one works. Same thing, though, basically. Now, I'm thinking that I don't like it because of how messy the wiring is. Of course, I don't know. Uh, hold on a second. Hold on a second. Okay, so I've decided and I'm going to do the one from the video. And hell, maybe maybe the wiring will get a little less messy as we're building it. So, let's get started. We're going to go a little bit over. Now, what we're going to... Why don't I have any pistons? I don't want the TNT. Uh, I don't want the sandstone. I don't want the cobblestone. But I have no pistons. What is this? What is this madness? Alright, so sticky pistons. There we go exactly what I needed. Alright, <laughs> so we're going to need, first of all, we're going to need the pistons that push the stairs out, and, uh, and, uh, oh, <laughs> I was about to say, oh, alright, what next? Alright, where's some stairs? I don't want some stairs, 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 okay, so we're going to do that, and then there'll be that, and then there'll be the two rows along the top, so what we're going to want is... Let's see, where's some stone here? Since it'll be pushing uh, this stone, which will be right here, we're gonna. Whoa. Alright, so it's gonna be want to be here. So, <laughs> put a piston there, and we go. Piston there, and there's gonna be also two on top. So there'll be those two pistons on top there. Now, um, and those, 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 we don't want that there, whoops, what did I do, what have I done, I don't want that there, so basically what we're making right now is, because when these are extended, we're going to want these ones pushing them out to get them in here, even, so, um, why don't I just do this, nah, 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 whoops, eh, Okay, so, now that we have our uh, two sticky pistons, four sticky pistons, see, now what these pistons are going to do is, once, uh, how am I going to explain this? Hold on a second. <laughs> it would be easier to explain if I do something. Alright, there we go, we'll put a black there, oops, black there, black there, push it. Okay, so, oops, got these need to be extended too. It's a bit of bullshit for me, but whatever. Uh, oh, that would be a much easier way. <laughs> that would be much easier way. Blah 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 blah. Anyways, <laughs> we're just gonna build some walls around here because we're not gonna be seeing much of that anyways anymore. Wait, wait. I want that there. <laughs> okay. Now, um, since I gotta get those two powered, I'm gonna power the blocks above them. So I'm gonna put that there, that there. I'm just gonna bring it down. Um, or should I? <laughs> or should I? Uh, I say we bring it down on. No, because if I power that block, like, if I power that. Guess what's gonna happen to the what the hell? 
Oh, never mind. Okay, that might work. No, that'll be bad. Alright, we're just gonna bring it down. <laughs> okay. And thereby getting power from that one, so then we just gotta power that one to get that there. But these ones are the ones that are powered last, so that's fine with that being there. See, now what we've done is this is powering this block. Just making sure I didn't mess up. Anyways, I'm just powering that block, which powers this redstone here, which powers these repeaters, which powers those, making them push out. And so it's shut. I always like to make it look like it's shut at first. So, now that we have that, um, let's hook up these. Oh, no. I'm just going to have to be rest on other back. <laughs> <laughs> Crap. <laughs> Alright, um, where can I power this from then? I don't want to put too much delay on it. <laughs> um, I say, I say, I don't know. Hmm. I say, we're gonna break that so we can get the power out there. And we're gonna do this, put the redstone there, and bring it up. So now our wall is completely hidden. I mean, it 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 works. There, that'll be fine. <laughs> so therefore, we can bring uh, this around. Oh shit! You know what? I should probably power these first. But anyways, we'll leave that like that while we have our power here for those. Now, what we're gonna want to do here is I don't like you. Um, <laughs> we're gonna <laughs> hook up. Some repeaters here, and then all that. What I like to do, I just bring that down, put a torch there, and we're all good. Now we do the same for the other side, which I have not even placed yet. Wow, I am smart. <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's get this hooked up. Yeah, there. Okay, so now we have those. Oops, oops, oops. Um. Scan repeater, more blocks, not that many blocks, that, and a torch. Now, what we're going to have to do, this is where the wiring started to get messy. <laughs> so, what we want is to hook up so this one and this one go off at the same time. <laughs> sure, it sounds easy, but it, it, it's not. <laughs> it's a pain in my ass. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna dig, dig like the moles we are. And yes, I am in a one block space. <laughs> of course it's all for education, how bad is it? Two, uh, three, four, holy shit, I'm a good counter. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, all right. And we don't have room for the other shit. <laughs> I guess the stairs could come out last. It all depends on what order I want this stuff in. But other than that, wait, is that 15? Yeah, okay. So, first of all, these ones have to come out first. Like, no matter what, they have to come out first. So, then, uh, over there, I put the uh, stairs out second. Actually, the stairs don't really matter. They can come out first either, but... The uh, this line here has to come uh, has to be activated before this line here, but other than that, the stairs could go first if you really wanted to. That might make my life easier. No, I don't know. Anyways, we're gonna bring. Uh, that over like that. So now we have a one space gap in between. 
So now, 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 now. Oh, well, the stairs come out last. Why not? So, what we're gonna have to do is hook up some inverters because just by the way I set it up, I don't know why. Um, we're gonna have to do it in proper order <laughs> so that they collapse properly. All in all, it doesn't really matter. No, it does. Alright, we'll do that, and that, and then that. So, it's open. It's open. Magnificent. Alright. Now, no, 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 no. I'm just going to build up a bit, make it look a little prettier. Okay. Now that we have our setup, that when it's open. So, this is so... We're gonna hook up a RS Norlatch array. So, first off, we're gonna dig down underneath these blocks just so we don't activate that. And put a redstone torch underneath. And we are gonna do this for each one, which is only three, so it's not that big a deal. Now, what we're gonna wanna do, I'm gonna break in here. We're gonna run want to run repeaters running from the far one over so yeah, and set it to four All right, there and then we're gonna run repeaters into each block and with a setting of one now we're gonna put some redstone on top of here put some torches on these blocks and um, put some torches on the other side as well now, now that we have this, this Minecraft addict gave me the idea for the RS no Now, Now, uh, we're going to put some repeaters coming off of each of the torches, running into a block. Whoops. A block. And then we put a block like that, hovering above the, uh, the repeater. And then, <laughs> it's like I can't think of what shit's names are. Anyways, we got to put redstone on the back of each of these. And then put a torch here, here, and here. So now that's an RS Norlatch. Well, technically these torches on the front aren't on a normal RS Norlatch array, or nor are these underneath. Just this, 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 and this. Actually, we didn't go over this in my basic redstone tutorial, because I haven't made another basic redstone tutorial with latches. So anyways, <laughs> now what we're going to do, we're going to run a repeater into each of these, uh, going forward. And then we run a repeater up here, going one. And we take this, and we take the rest of it, and we go like that. We go smashy, smashy. And we go diggy, diggy. And place that there, that there, and that there. And then we do the same for the other ones. Smashy, smashy, and some more diggy, diggy. And place, place. Oh, I'm getting blinded now. Now, this is what wasn't in our uh, Minecraft addicts. You know. So, now that we have that, we have basically everything we need. That is all you need. Now, if you wanted to hook up a lever, you just run some redstone off of this and hook up a lever to the end of it. But, like I've said before, I do not like levers. No, no, no. Buttons are the way to go. So, I have to hook up a T flip flop. Very easy to make. I'll show you right now. Um, so block there, block there, block there, and a block there. Looks complicated, it's not. So, but I always forget where to place the torches because there's so goddamn many of them. There, uh, everywhere on that thing, you need to place torches. Now, this is a much more compact RS Snow Latch than others. So, I don't know. This this is my favorite. I mean, why did I say R Snowlatch? This is my favorite T flip flop, uh, I'd have to say. Other than my one black line one, which I'm still not that fond of. <laughs> Alright, so, now that we have that hooked up, we're gonna put a block here, because normally you'd put the button there, but I'm gonna run a repeater into it and run some redstone off of it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Oh, 15. Oh. Uh, I'll put some redstone there. A, uh, that there. 
Actually, that'd be a very bad idea putting a torch underneath there. All right, or there for that fact. Dang it! So I gotta actually move all the way over here. Okay. Um, it's just how I'm hooking up the button. So there. Now that we have the button hooked up, we push our button and it will shut. Ho ho ho! Magical. Hit our button again. And it goes. What? That was not supposed to go first. I'm very confused now. Well, it's retracted last. Oh, because it's the reverse order. Why didn't I not think of this? Um. Or not. Oh! It's the reverse order when it's coming back. So putting this as third actually puts it at first when it's sticking out because at the moment it's retracted. I did not think about that. And since it's a reverse order, this torch will go out first, which pushes out the stairs. And then this one will go on, which does blah, blah, blah. So, that's it. I, that, that's how it works. Um, <laughs> Alright, so let's let's show you how it works a little bit better, I guess. We're going to put a button here just to show you what the T flip flop does. So, we hit a button, and as you can see, the. Oh, is that lag? Because they all turned off at once. Um, you hit this button, and the torches light up in sequence. And then they light back in the opposite sequence. So, what that does is it makes it so that this is triggered first, and then it's triggered last next time, so that they actually go back into their proper order. Doink, doink. Aha, yes, excellent. But that, um, yeah, I think that'll be the end of the tutorial, but I'm going to show you guys something. I have actually implemented this into my real world. My real world, yay. Whoops, whoops. And uh, I do this, uh, ugh, in this world, I pretty, mostly do legit. Uh, the rest is creative. Um, like that creeper there. No way I would collect that much wool. That, I actually collected all that glass and made it myself. It was a pain in the ass. Anyways, um, I'll show you where I have implemented the indoor. So if we go in here into my lounge area, this is not the normal texture pack I use, and so that's not supposed to look good. Anyways, <laughs> oops, oh man, ah, rage. Okay, now this here is my um, the shelf for the bar, and so I thought, oh man, this could be a great opportunity. So I hit a button underneath the trap door. And drink, drink, and it opens up this little, nice little stairway for me. It does not lead anywhere yet. <laughs> and I've hooked up a button on the other side so that it shuts. Drink. Hooray! So, yeah, that's how that works. I had fun with it. And so, I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial, and um, see you guys next time.